Almost two days after the incident, Will Smith issued a public apology to Chris Rock and to all who have witnessed his rage. Smith, who had pointedly not apologized to Rock when he accepted the award for Best Actor, wrote on Instagram saying, I would like to publicly apologize to you, Chris. I was out of line and I was wrong, he said in the statement. But before the public apology and after it, Will kept on receiving backlash both from social media and fellow celebrities. Realizing everything he did wrong, what does Will Smith have to say about it and the media backlash he is currently receiving? There might not be a day passing by without passing through a Chris Rock Will Smith meme. The I Am Legend actor has been the subject of ridiculous memes lately, but has the actor said anything about it yet? Has he already expressed remorse? We'll find out the answer to that in this video. But first, make sure that you subscribe to our channel and you smash that notification bell for more updates on this. Now, let's begin. Violence in all of its forms is poisonous and destructive. My behavior at last night's Academy Awards was unacceptable and inexcusable. Jokes made at my expense are part of the job, but a joke about Jada's medical condition was too much for me to bear and I reacted emotionally, Smith wrote. I would like to publicly apologize to you, Chris. I was out of line and I was wrong. I am embarrassed and my actions were not indicative of the man I want to be. There is no place for violence in a world of love and kindness, Will Smith started his long Instagram post almost two days after the slapping incident at the 2022 Oscars. In case you're living under a rock, the viral slap that occurred at the 2022 Academy Awards this past Sunday as a joke about Jada Pinkett Smith's hair loss triggered multi-awarded actor Will Smith that prompted him to slap the show's host, Chris Rock, right in his face. For his part, the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air alum later referenced and apologized for the altercation in his speech when accepting his Oscar for King Richard. I want to apologize to the Academy. I want to apologize to all my fellow nominees, he added. Art imitates life. I look like a crazy father, just like they said about Richard Williams. But love will make you do crazy things, Will said. However, he did not directly apologize to Chris Rock, whom he slapped in the first place so he issued a public apology the following night. The post continued, I would also like to apologize to the Academy, the producers of the show, all the attendees, and everyone watching around the world. I would like to apologize to the Williams family and my King Richard family. I deeply regret that my behavior has stained what has been an otherwise gorgeous journey for all of us. I am a work in progress. The apology from the King Richard star arrived less than 24 hours after the incident, just as the criticism against Smith's aggressive behavior was building. The Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences said that it has initiated a formal review and investigation into the incident, as Oscars producer Will Packer and SAG-AFTRA chimed in. While Smith is unlikely to lose his Oscar, a full Board of Governors meeting on May 30 will undoubtedly raise many questions regarding why the actor was not removed from his Dolby Theatre front row seat after assaulting Rock. Getting into trouble with the Ampas couldn't have happened at a worse time for the actor, who was on the rise again thanks to franchise films like Aladdin, which became his highest grossing film at $1.05 billion, and Sony's Bad Boys for Life which debuted just before 2020 and grossed over $426 million worldwide. With Coda winning Best Picture, there's no doubt that Apple will be back in future Oscar campaigns. Emancipation, the Antoine Fuqua-directed package featuring Smith that Apple paid $120 million for, is one such possible awards bait title, as Deadline first revealed. Smith is a runaway slave who must outwit cold-blooded hunters and the inhospitable swamps of Louisiana on a perilous trek north to join the Union Army. Any Ampas reprimand of Smith would be a setback for what is expected to be a prominent and well-respected feature. Meanwhile, Will Smith has resigned from the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences following the massive media backlash he has gotten over the past few days. It hasn't even been a week, but his famous slap has already taken over the internet. Smith was already facing expulsion from the Academy following an investigation into the incident at the Academy Awards on Sunday, in which he walked on stage and slapped Rock, who had just made a joke about his wife, Jada Pinkett Smith, and her alopecia diagnosis.
The following is the text of the statement, which was released on Friday afternoon. I have directly responded to the Academy's disciplinary hearing notice, and I will fully accept any and all consequences for my conduct. My actions at the 94th Academy Awards presentation were shocking, painful, and inexcusable. The list of those I have hurt is long and includes Chris, his family, many of my dear friends and loved ones, all those in attendance, and global audiences at home. I betrayed the trust of the Academy. I deprived other nominees and winners of their opportunity to celebrate and be celebrated for their extraordinary work. I am heartbroken. I want to put the focus back on those who deserve attention for their achievements and allow the Academy to get back to the incredible work it does to support creativity and artistry in film. So, I am resigning from membership in the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences and will accept any further consequences the board deems appropriate. Changes take time, and I am committed to doing the work to ensure that I never again allow violence to overtake reason. The resignation was verified by the Academy shortly after Smith's statement was released. The president of the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences, David Rubin, also published a statement on Friday afternoon, saying, We have received and accepted Mr. Will Smith's immediate resignation from the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences. We will continue to move forward with our disciplinary proceedings against Mr. Smith for violations of the Academy standards of conduct in advance of our next scheduled board meeting on April 18. This move comes just days after the Academy announced that disciplinary hearings were underway and that a vote on whether to suspend or expel Smith would happen in April. Previous members who faced expulsion from the Academy included Roman Polanski, Bill Cosby, and Harvey Weinstein. From his perspective, I think this is a question of optics, said Eric Cohn, the executive editor at IndieWire. He's doing the quote-unquote right thing, and that will also allow people to start to see him in a more agreeable light. Cohn also mentioned that for Smith to fully save face, he will need to show real contrition, not only to his fans, but to the entertainment world. Several investigations have been launched as a result of the altercation, and the Los Angeles Police Department even detailed that officers were backstage prepared to arrest Smith, though Rock denied pressing charges. It was not immediately clear whether Smith would be able to keep his Oscar for Best Actor, which he just won for his role in King Richard at Sunday's awards ceremony. Neither Polanski nor Weinstein's Academy Awards were revoked following their expulsion. It's also worth noting that you don't have to be a member of the Academy to be nominated for an Oscar. In principle, the Academy owns the Oscar statuettes that they present to prize recipients, so they might pursue them, but Cohn believes that such a move would be unlikely. Apparently, Will Smith's win as Best Actor for his performance in King Richard is not what will go down in Oscar's history. Instead, Everyone is talking about how he went on stage to slap presenter Chris Rock in the face after taking offense at a joke made by the latter, which referenced the hairstyle of his wife, Jada Pinkett Smith. Often known as one of Tinseltown's most affable superstars, the former Fresh Prince's online mea culpa likely will end any speculation that Rock still could file a police report. While Chris Rock said he wouldn't be filing any legal cases, there is still six months for him to change his mind. What about you? Do you think Will Smith deserves all the backlash, or was he just as much a victim as Chris was? Let us know in the comments below, and don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button, and smash that notification bell for more episodes.